At CES 2019, Intel returned to make a slew of announcements about, you guessed it, CPUs. Welcome to All Hands on Tech, I'm Brian Jackson. We're recapping Intel's highlights from the world's largest consumer electronics show. Intel's marketing message these days is that it's no longer a PC-centric firm, but a data-centric firm. But that doesn't mean it's giving up on its legacy of pushing the edge on processor technology. Far from it. Intel announced six new ninth generation processors for desktop PCs at the show. Intel says these are designed to meet a range of end user needs, including those of serious content creators. The first chip in the group will be out this month. The rest will start shipping in the second quarter of this year. When it comes to mobile PCs, and that's what Intel calls laptops and two-in-one devices, there's a new platform coming, and it's codenamed Ice Lake. It's a 10 nanometer chip, and it features a new graphics architecture. It integrates Thunderbolt 3 and Wi-Fi 6 standards. It also features Intel's DL Boost feature, meant to accelerate artificial intelligence workloads. Intel also gave us a sneak peek at its Lakefield platform. This CPU takes different components that used to be separately packaged and fits them all into one chip. It should help laptop makers create even thinner and lighter devices. Intel is saving on space by using a special new design approach called Fulverose 3D Packaging Technology. Instead of needing to put everything on one flat board, it can now take advantage of vertical space and stack its design. The Ice Lake platform will also play a role in the data center. Intel previewed a 10 nanometer Xeon processor for servers. These are expected to enhance both performance and security, but they won't be shipped until next year. For this year, Intel is releasing Xeon processors on its 14 nanometer Cascade Lake platform. That includes a processor with 48 cores and it integrates Intel's Optane memory as well as its Deep Learning Boost technology. Intel showed on stage demos showing that its chip's performance on an AI workload was five times better than the previous generation Xeon processor assisted by a GPU. Finally, Intel announced a totally new processor that's purpose-built for inference AI workloads. The Nirvana Neural Network Processor is expected to go into production this year. Intel will be partnering with Facebook on developing the chip, a company that might be interested in the image recognition applications for this chip. Also, look for a neural network processor specifically for training models, codenamed Springcrest, released later this year. By the way, inference-based AI is a type of deep learning that works based on recognizing rewards. It's one type of AI that doesn't require a huge amount of data to be useful, so many firms are interesting in advancing it. So those are the new Intel processor updates coming your way in 2019. Thanks for watching All Hands on Tech. From CES 2019, I'm Brian Jackson reporting for IT World Canada. Subscribe to this channel for more videos from the world's largest consumer electronics show.